Hello again, I want to welcome you all back to another video where you can join me while we make a big mess. I've given this canvas here two coats of glass paint, of all things, and uh, it was a swipe, but it, I didn't like it. So I've put on some of that glass paint and it's given it like a really nice sheen. So whether or not it's even going to work as a background cover, I just don't know. So we'll see. You'll see with me. So what we've got today is this red paint. It's a Colvin & Co Crimson Red and I've mixed it half and half with glass paint, the same one that I used on the canvas, which is this one. I had it, so I'm trying it. <laughs> and then we've got this yellow. It's really, really bright. So uh, for this one I've used Yellow Mid, Colvin & Co and a really cheap neon craft paint, half and half, so that's that. Then for the next one we've got orange, which is Colvin & Co also, and to that I've added some of this Metallic Magic pigment, which is for my resin. Again, because I've got it, why not? So these are all one part paint, one part of this clear paper glue, and about one part water. Some of them took a bit more and some of them took a bit less. And then I've mixed up some black. This is a pre-mix of one part Brunel Franklin's Mars Black with one part clear paper glue and one part water. And for the white, the same. I've used the Everbuild All Purpose Silicon and I've used that in the a dark red which I've mixed up. Again it's just the crimson red but I've added some black to it to give me a really deep red. So that's got two squirts of silicon in a very small amount of paint and then we've got the orange two squirts of silicon. We've got the yellow three squirts of silicon. Normally I'll squirt it into a little cup and catch the drips and then pour the drips in so that I know how much I'm getting. Today I just squirted them in the cup. So we'll see. I've not even mixed them since either, which I'll do in a moment. Uh, I'm going to stick some gloves on because I've probably got silicon on my hands and I've just been touching the canvas, which is great stuff. So, all that said, I'll shift my canvas about, edit all the scuffling, hopefully so I don't make you all feel sick. in this, which is... Uh, Elizabeth Harris cake lifty slicey do for you what's it what is it even called a stainless steel oh. cake lifter I've also got myself this palette knife so I'm going to use these handy little tools and see if I have any better luck with swiping than I usually have because I've really not had any success there's none I like so far so I've got a plan in my mind of what I'm going to do with these paints. I'm going to be swiping towards me um, with this red, the crimson and the glass paint, as my swipe colour, which is a bit different. I like to swipe white and I like to swipe black. This time I'm going to swipe red. Right, so I'm going to start with some dark red. And this one's a little bit thicker mm, than I might usually use but I'm okay with it there's only a real little bit of this paint because it was an afterthought so I will start out down here with it I'm going to put myself a nice it's like half an inch wide streak I'll just put that on here like so. I'll do that in a few different places. Well, this has got quite a lot of texture on this canvas. There's some areas that had cracked on the previous swipe. There's some raised areas where I've tried to swipe it off. There's little pock marks 
think I've probably got too much silicon or something. Or perhaps there were just air bubbles that I hadn't took the time to take out. Either way, I didn't like it. So it's no loss today if this doesn't work. Because it was already a mess. Right. I re as I say, I don't want much of this colour in the painting. Here. I'm going to be a little bit more uniform in the way that I put the paint down. Do you know I'm sweltering now? The sun's shining. It's heating up in here really fast. And of course when I came out here, I was dithering a little bit. I was real sleepy head going on and cold. So I put the heater on. I shut all the windows. <laughs> now it's, I'm really melting. My jumper, my slippers. <laughs> all of that. I'm going for comfort today because I'm just overtired. Art therapy. Hopefully I'm working in a way that you can see and don't keep covering myself up with the cup. I do apologise, I've not gone for this angle before. Okay, stick a bit of this down here and that will be my last one. orange and I'm going to follow each one of these first with the orange. This is a lot runnier and as I say bubbly. Oops. Hopefully I don't really want to be sat here putting the paint on for the next half an hour making you guys watch things taking it right. <laughs> I think I can actually see a lumpy bit there. You'll have to see, I'll get it later. Spin men really need to go away now. I was waiting, stood here. It was an excuse for another coffee. <laughs> waiting for the bin men to move out from the front of my workshop. So, today, as much as I'm go going to try and not make the video take forever, I have as much time as I like. The children are at school. I'm experiencing my first time of my youngest child being in full-time education. So I now have got rid of the pesky middle of the day school run. And I just have nine and three. And it's such a relief. I was so tied out here in the village with the school run. Knowing that wherever I go, I've got about two hours to be back. Not that I really go anywhere. Right. Ooh, do you know what? These are really beautiful. The, the red is mingled a little bit with the orange already. I'm excited. And this yellow is just so vibrant. Right, we're going to go again. We're just going to put the yellow the same way. Ooh, it smells nice. I wonder why. Not that you should be smelling paint, anybody, but... It smells fruity. Oh, it's really not 
we're going to make one little bit of a difference these sloppy bits but I don't like it all the same So yesterday was the first day the kids went back, which was great, but I guiltily have to admit, I crawled back into my bed. <laughs> had a lovely long daytime nap. It's probably why I feel so groggy today, maybe. Witter, witter, witter. <laughs> but on that note, my little boy has a repetitive motion, head banging sleep disorder and um, you can find yourself up 30 times a night and it had eased off through the holidays it was great he was having movie nights and sleepovers with his sister most of the time and uh, we really didn't get much of a problem with the banging but the poor lad's obviously got something on his mind because his sleep levels are just weird and he was at it Monday night the night before school <laughs> I went to sleep at half four in the morning. When my partner told me the next day, yeah, that's just when he took over and I'd stopped hearing. <laughs> so yeah, it's not been too fun. It's like having a newborn for four years. Right, so we've got some pretty little uniform areas on here. I think I should probably put another one on, on there, if I can get any more red out. Let's see. Is it coming? Come on. I can do it. stirring the silicon did I? Except from what I just do naturally when I pick them up. So all three of these colours have got silicon squirted onto the top of them and perhaps a small nick. So the plan from here, I'm not sure how I'm going to put the rest of the colours out onto the canvas just to get enough paint. We don't know, we will see. Just same thing again, except I'll add a little bit of red in there. Let's hope this this way. from that one the last swipe. But if I carry on in this way I'm just going to have all yellow except from the colours that I swipe this way. I don't know whether that's a good thing or not. Keep 
mocking you with this hand, don't I? Sorry! What do you think? If you were voting so far, is this going to work? I don't know. I hope so, because it has really been sat here for two weeks and I've been desperate to get out here. Every time I've come in here and got to ready point, someone's turned up or someone's needed me or Elizabeth's massacring the lawn so I have to go out and take her off. Just usual, usual things. But hopefully this is the start of beautiful things, because I'll have all day, every day, between sleeping, <laughs> and find that balance, because I'm like a zombie. I think up here, to stop it all being yellow, I'll probably send a couple of these back the other way. I'll show you in a sec. See, this is still taking me quite a while, even though I'm trying not to dilly dally. I'm going to have quite a big yellow thing going on. So I'll just take a couple of these and this, this. Which one? This one. And this one. I have an even darker paint over there that I, I achieved by accident when I was trying to make up my dark red. Oh, I've just mixed way too much black in. It's more like, it's like a really rich brown that I made. So I could put some of that on if I find that I haven't got enough paint. Or I could put some white or actually incorporate the black into the picture, which I really wasn't I'm planning on doing. Um, I don't think we need any more yellow on there, but I think I will put a little bit of this brown. Here it is. Just give it a quick stir. I keep talking really quietly, don't I? I hope you can hear me. Now this one's still quite thick because it was my reject paint. Oh no, maybe it's not too thick. Hmm. I'm going to add a, just a touch of water, water to that. Got something in my water. Much better. I'm just going to put tiny, tiny little bits of this because I don't really want it to be a dark picture and it's going to be quite dark with the black that I'm swiping with the red. I suppose I could put some white on it. I don't think it'll go too well though. Where shall I put this? I'm going to put it on the back end of this red here. Might just be a huge mistake. No such thing as mistakes with that. <laughs> I keep telling myself. But there is, because I clearly hate this one. Although, the video to it just went walk about. It was quite a while ago when I was struggling to edit, struggling to anything, struggling to even import it into my computer. Um, I know I don't have enough paint on here yet. lovely bit in my yellow. <laughs> Since I'm swiping them all together anyway, it's 
not a big deal. good thing about this is this canvas is beautifully taut. I think I'd already put the little keys in the back. Oh, no, I'm lying. I haven't. I um, put water on the back and then it was one of the ones that I, I put a coat of general purpose primer on it. Two coats, in fact. And then let that dry. And then I painted. That painting had silicon in it. Then I put this glass seal. So really I was being all sorts in this canvas. It doesn't bode well for how it's actually going to turn out. I've actually, I'm going to do a black and white one sometime soon. Pretty much just blacks and whites. See what I can achieve with that because there's a hairdressers in town that have a kind of black and white theme. I'll we'll see if I can entice the owner to display it. Um, I'll just put some more of the standard red which is not really going to show because of the red swipe but it will. sloppy now. <laughs> All that care in the first place. Okay, I'm quite liking it. I continue putting yellow on, even though I probably shouldn't. One, because it's what I've got, and two, because I want this end to be lighter overall. Just also want there to be enough paint.
probably is overkill now. <laughs> Definitely didn't want as much of these dark ones on there, but without filling it full of this crimson red, which I don't want to do with that being my swipe colour, I've not got a lot of choice. Um, put one there just because it would be really not to. Oh, and I splatter it across the place too. Okay, it's looking a bit better for paint coverage anyway. Looking, seeing what strikes me. Oh, that's a bit glob going off the side there. Alright, so I'm going to move around to the other side and put my swipe and colour on. Let's give these a little shift. Ooh, it's quite pretty in its own right. I just like colours. minutes that took my camera's now flashing its low battery just to make my day my cable's inside I thought I'd play roulette <laughs> I figured it would last Raped up some stuff there, clumpy bits off the sides. Another thing that I've been thinking about is whether or not this swipe is going to be too heavy for the uh, ineffective swipe. I have got some acetate sheets somewhere, but I can't find them. I haven't looked very hard. Want to try another day? Okay, keep a little tiny bit just for touch ups. And then, brave or stupid, I'm not sure which, but I'm putting a little line. Do we think if we've got enough paint?
yeah, if it's not enough paint, it's tough. I'll fix it. Right, I'm going to move around. I'm going to attempt to give it a swipe with this trusty rod. Mm, fingers crossed. Excuse me. Right. So I'm just going to let its own weight do it because it is a heavy little beast. Um, hopefully not in your way. And I'll go for a two-hander. If I'd have had an even pressure on that, it would have been perfect. Right, so, swipe it again. a swipe and I really wasn't very even either. So I'm just going to use this one now and I'm going to go over and be a little bit more precise and I hate re-swiping. I'm going to have to because it's just not covered nicely. Okay, so we're going to take a bit more of this red up. We're going to destroy all these beautiful cells. Well, uh, there we go. Trust it, guys.
Oh yeah. Even though it's not an especially amazing piece, the camera's not doing it any justice at all. Let's see if I can't show you any of this detail. These are all like yellow, inside orange, inside red. It's not showing. Never mind, I'll snap some pictures on my phone to uh, show you some of the interesting areas and show you a more accurate idea of the colours that are in this piece. 